Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to discuss the example for complex number. Given the two complex number, where we have z sub 1 is equal to 5 plus 3i, and the z sub 2 is equal to 2 minus i. A. State the conjugate of z sub 1 and the conjugate of z sub 2. So here we have the conjugate of z sub 1, where we have to focus on the imaginary part, opposite the sign. So where we have 5 minus 3i. Next, the conjugate of z sub 2. Again, focus on the imaginary part, opposite the situation. So where we will have 2 plus i. Next, b. Determine of the value k if the situation where we have 1 over z sub 1. So 1 over z sub 1, where we have 5 plus 3i is equal to k multiply with the conjugate of z sub 1. So where we will have 5 minus 3i. So my suggestion is to divide the situation, or we can say rearrange so that k as a subject. So k is equal to 1 over 5 plus 3i multiply with 5 minus 3i. So what we can do is to focus on the denominator part where we have 5 plus 3i multiply with 5 minus 3i where we have the multiplication of the conjugate to each other. So my suggestion is to make use of the formula where we have a squared plus b squared. So k is equal to 1 over 5 squared where we will have 25 plus with 3 squared where we will have 9. So the value of k will be equal to 1 over 34. Next, we have part C. Find the multiplication of z sub 1 with z sub 2. So in here, z sub 1 multiply with the z sub 2, where we have z sub 1 as a 5 plus 3i. Multiply with the z sub 2, where we have 2 minus i. Can you expand the situation? So we will have, we have 10 minus 5i plus 6i then we have negative 3. Multiply with the i squared where we have negative 1, so it becomes positive 3. So the multiplication for z sub 1 with the z sub 2 is equal to 13 plus with the i. So here we have the situation. <coughs> Hence, shows that we have the conjugate for z sub 1 multiplied with the z sub 2. So here we have z sub 1 multiplied with the z sub 2 here we have to conjugate, so it will become 13 minus i. Next, what we have to do is to find the conjugate for z sub 1 multiply with the conjugate of z sub 2. So the conjugate for z sub 1 multiply with the conjugate of z sub 2 is equal to 5 minus 3i multiply with 2 plus i. Can we expand the situation? So where we have 10 plus with 5i minus 6i then minus 3, multiply with the i squared, where we have negative 1 for the i squared, so here we will have positive 3. So the conjugate for z sub 1, multiply with the conjugate of z sub 2, is equal to 13 minus i. So in here, as we can see that, 13 minus i actually is equal to the conjugate for the situation, z sub 1, multiply with the z sub 2. So as a conclusion, the conjugate for z sub 1, multiply with the conjugate of z sub 2, is equal to the conjugate of z sub 1 multiplied with the z sub 2. So we already shown the situation. If you are new here, kindly consider subscribing to this channel and share this video to your friend. Thank you so much for watching this video. Bye.